एवरीवन आई यू रेडी टू फाइंड आउट विच ए आई टूल इज ट्रूली अ गेम चेंजर टूडे वी आर डाइविंग इन टू दी शो डाउन बिटवीन जेमिनाई सी एल आई एंड क्लॉड कोड टू पावरफुल टूल्स दैट आर रिवोल्यूशनाइजिंग द वे डेवलपर्स राइट कोड बट विच वन रीन सुप्रीम लेट्स फाइंड इट आउट So first up we've got Gemini CLI powered by Google's Gemini model. This tool isn't just for coding. It's an entire AI ecosystem with capabilities that go beyond writing code. Gemini CLI helps you manage files, perform web searches and tackle massive multi-file code bases. It's incredible 1 million token context window let it handle large scale projects with ease and with its open source nature and generous free tier it's a versatile and cost effective choice for developers and on the other hand we have got cloud code by anthropic this tool is all about quality and precision it's built specifically to help you write clean production ready code manage complex multi file edits and even automate git operations While it may have a smaller context window than Gemini, its focus on high quality code generation which makes it the go-to for developers who need reliability and efficiency in their project. So here's what we are going to cover today. First of all, we'll take a look at Gemini CLI, walk you through its installation and explore its unique features. Next up, we'll set up Cloud Code and see how it offers a more structured, polished approach to coding. And finally we'll put both tools to the test by building an app side by side so you can see first hand which one stake the crown and as the best AI coding tool. So let's jump in and see who comes out on the top. Now before we move on if you are interested in mastering the future of technology then the professional certificate course in generative AI and machine learning is the perfect opportunity for you. This is offered in collaboration with ENIC Academy IIT Kanpur. This 11 month live and interactive program will provide you hands on expertise in cutting edge areas like generative AI machine learning and tools like ChatGPT DALI 2 and even Hugging Face. You'll be gaining practical experience through 15 plus projects, integrated labs, and live master classes delivered by esteemed IIT Kanpur faculty. And alongside, you'll earn a prestigious certificate from IIT Kanpur. You'll also receive official Microsoft badges for Azure AI courses and career support through Simply Learn's Job Assist program. So, what are you waiting for? Hurry up and enroll now, and you can find the course link below. Now before we dive deeper let me ask you this question what is the primary function of a large language model like gemini or cloud your options are to process and analyze images and videos to control the physical movement of a robot to understand and generate human like text or to create new original code and design concept Don't forget to mention your answers in the comment section below. Now before moving forward, I request you guys to not forget to hit the subscribe button and click the bell icon so you do not miss out any future updates from Simply Learn. So let's get started. So let's get started with the installation part. So first, you need to make sure that you have already installed node.js and then head over to Anthropic Cloud Code website. Here, you'll find the command and just copy the command from here to install cloud and then we'll go to terminal and we'll just copy paste the command so now as you can see that our packages have been installed that is a cloud and to check it you can just type in cloud here all right so now as you can see that it's mentioning me that you can trust this files in this folder not so i'll just click on yes proceed and it says welcome to cloud code that means that our cloud has been successfully installed now our second step is installing gemini cli So what we'll do is we'll just copy this command from here we'll go back to our terminal and from here we'll just copy paste the command and just we'll wait for a few minutes So now as you can see that our Google Gemini CLI has been installed in my system it says added 476 packages in 2 minutes so it took a bit of time then we installed cloud here now what we'll do is we'll go to vs code and from here we'll just select file and then we'll click we'll just select file and from here we can just select open folder so i have my cloud code minimal folder from here i'll be selecting this folder now now after i selected it this is my uh, program file name i'll add one more file name which named as a uh, cloud code new okay and now i'll just go to terminal from here select new terminal and now what we'll do is we'll again type in cloud to actually see that if it's working or not Okay. Now it says welcome to Claude. That means successfully it has been done. We'll do it again for Gemini CLI as well. 
Now again, I'll be opening one more new window and select on open folder. And then I'll select Gemini CLI from here. So from here, I'll be selecting CLI folder and I'll just click on select folder. And we'll be creating one more new file as minimalistic website. Let's suppose this is my file name and I'll just remove this gap from here. Okay, I'll just change the name again, minimal web. All right. Now what I'll do is, again, I'll type in here Gemini to check the Gemini installation. And guys, here you can see that our Gemini has been successfully installed. And these are the tips for getting started. So what I'll do is, I'll just enter a command and I'll just say to create an e-commerce website for both the Gemini CLI as well as Cloud Code. And let's see which performs better. So first, I have this Cloud Code from here. And I've given the prompt to create a minimalistic e-commerce website named as Minimal Mart using HTML, CSS and JavaScript. I want the design to be clean, modern, easy to navigate and use a light background with subtle accent colors. And I want the homepage which should include a hero banner, product categories, a grid style product listing as image, name, price, add to cart and also the search bar at the top. And I've also told to add a add to cart button. Now... We'll just click on enter and let's see it has started to create this directory first. So it says I'll create minimalistic e-commerce website with all the features you requested. Now let me plan first. And now it has come up with all the to-dos and it's going on to create HTML structure for homepage with hero banner. Now it has already started with creating the HTML file. We'll go to Gemini and we'll give the same prompt to create a minimalistic e-commerce website and just hit on enter. Now Gemini says it's planning minimal art design, structuring minimal marts pages. Well, we'll wait for a few minutes. So guys, as you can see, it has already told me the plan, what it is. And it says I will create the project structure and also add content to each file. And here I have it, MKDI minimal mart, allow execution. So I'll just select on yes, allow always. So as you can see, it has already created a file folder as minimal mart from here. Now you don't actually have to do anything. Just sit and relax and this Gemini will do everything for you. Also, how can I forget Claude? I'll be showing you that also. Well, I'll just select here as allow always. You can do it with your arrow button. And it has started to generate the code for me. Meanwhile, I'll go back to my uh, Claude. And let's see what it has done. Well, it's taking time to create the HTML structure for homepage. Still, it is working on the index.html file. All right. So from here, you can again see the code. Both are pretty fast at creating code. But what I felt is Gemini CLI is a bit more faster. And then it says, do you want to make this edit? Yes, of course. Allow this all the time. Okay. So now Claude is working on structuring the home page. So as you can see, it has crossed this line. It means it has already created HTML structure for home page. And now it's working on to create product detail page with HTML structure. And meanwhile, Gemini is working on to create JavaScript code. And it has already done uh, added card, product, index, HTML are already done. And it's working on JavaScript. Well, it's pretty fast as compared to uh, Claude. So yeah, it says I have created the Minimal Mart website with a clean, modern, responsive design and the file structure directory includes index style. It's pretty fast, right? Now we'll see uh, Claude as well because I started earlier with Claude and Gemini actually took up the race and it went more faster. Well, here I can see that Gemini actually wins the game. So I'll just select on go live and see what type of uh, website has it created now. So guys, this is the website it has created named as Minimal Mart. Welcome to Minimal Mart. And these are the product categories, category one, the featured product. And it has also added the option of added to cart. Well, it looks pretty good to me. But what I felt is the UX, the design is bit very normal. And it has used similar type of images and icons to show this, right? It's more like black and white color shade. Well, it's fine. We'll just add more functionalities to Gemini and say to do some corrections. Meanwhile, let's see what Claude has done. So it's still working on creating the CSS styling with clean modern design. Now, 
what I'll do is I'll go back to my uh, website from here and I'll say please add dark blue color background and also more functionalities dark and light theme change button along with that I want you to add more product electronic items and name with its similar image okay so let's see what uh, what type of changes will it do for me now it says it's analyzing feature additions and it's designing theme functionality all right we'll just wait till it does okay here's a plan it will update and it will also add theme toggle button add javascript to handle the switching to save the user's preference okay well cool now we have claude here it's just still working on right takes a bit of time so gemini is pretty fast as compared to claude looking back to our gemini cli it is already it started to adding more html elements from here and you can just look at the code from here so it's editing and now adding more functionalities and features what i already told gemini to do it also one more thing you can also look at the number of tokens it is generating while doing performing the code analysis from here and yes finally claude has completed its task and it says i have successfully created a complete minimalistic e-commerce website all right now just let's test it and have a look what type of website has it created well i'm pretty excited okay this looks better okay now it has added like welcome to minimal mart and this is electronics clothing home just look at the while i hover just look at the option the animations it's giving i'm pretty impressed by this because uh when i look at gemini's uh feature i'm pretty impressed by this because just look at the hover and the animations and this is of uh gemini cli and i told it to create edit and this is what it did for me it looks good to me the color layout which i told to add dark blue it has done that and these are the product categories this is the shop now option so while i click on that you see all products option you can add it to cart and it says product added to cart okay you have headphones camera smartphones this is fine looks good you have home option shop option and cart right so you can while you add you can also look at the cart and number what is the total price of the option you can also have this contact option where you can enter your name let's suppose i enter my name and i have my email from here and you can also send a message it actually works and okay this looks pretty good to me but then if compared i also like claude code result because this looks more sleek and more minimalistic now let's see if i give the changes to claude what it does for me so i have told a uh, claude to make the background dark blue and purple color i need more interactive ui ux design and add button of dark and night mode option for the user let's see what type of changes it does for me well in the case of gemini i told it to add a button of dark and night mode i could not actually see so i'll be saying it again dark and night mode button option i need in front home page okay so it's considering the placement now and it's making changes again meanwhile as you can see a uh, cloud code is updating css with dark blue and purple background themes and it will take well now honestly to be said starting i felt gemini cli is pretty faster but then while you look at the results i feel claude code wins this game because it took time but the result it gave it to me is pretty awesome right i mean you yourself can compare from here this and this right now let's add more um, features here which i have told them to add it and let's compare the final version All right. So Claude here has successfully done the changes. It says I have transformed the Minimal Mart website with a stunning dark blue purple theme and these are the changes it did the new visual design, dark mode and night mode toggle options, enhanced interactive elements, advanced animation. Let's have a look at the final look of our website using Claude code. 
So guys, this is the final look of our website using Cloud Code. It says "Welcome to Minimal Mart," and just look at the animations it has added. This is pretty impressive, right? Look at the cursor while I just move it. It's like a circular purple color theme, which is pretty impressive. And the other options: electronics, clothing, home and garden, books. And while I hover to this, it actually floats, right? So it has added a lot of animations. What I felt is the color, which I already told purple, so it's not visible much in this background. We can obviously change that. This is just a minor mistake. But apart from this, this looks pretty cool to me. The animations, the styling is actually good. Let's look at the option of the dark and night mode. So as you can see, if I just click on this, this is a dark mode, and if user want a light mode, they can click on this. This is such a cool feature it has added, and this works so smooth. Now, in the case of Gemini, let's have a look if it has done the changes for me. So it says I've updated. All right, it has updated and done all the changes. I'll just go back to my website and reload this. So this is the final look of my website. Welcome to Minimal Mart. Again, the color theme which I feel we could have done it maybe black color. Now this is also one more major minor mistake. And guys. It has finally added this dark and night mode, right? So this is the light mode, and this is the dark mode. I like the dark mode. Now let me know which one you liked it, because according to me, I liked. Uh, repeat. Now, according to me, if you ask, I feel Gemini has added a more of pictures here and try to make it interactive, but then it was pretty fast as we compare to Claude Code. But then, if you look at Claude Code's result, it took a lot of time, but the styling, the layout, and the animation it it added is pretty awesome and appreciable. So I would go for Claude Code definitely, and let me know which one you like the most. And with that, we have come to the end of this tutorial. If you have any doubts or questions, ask them in the comment section below. Our team of experts will reply you as soon as possible. Thank you and keep learning with Simply Learn. Hi there! If you like this video, subscribe to Simply Learn YouTube channel. channel and click here to watch similar videos to know up and get certified you can check the description box below